It's frustrating to have someone steal from you, but imagine watching it happen. The manager of Bayou Construction off of Bragg Circle in Beaumont has the entire crime recorded, including the burglar looking in the refrigerator. KFDM's Justin Hinton reports the business is taking steps to stop the next would-be burglar and hopes you'll help police catch the last one. What you're seeing is a burglar smashing a truck into the door of this business. It wasn't on the hinges at the bottom, so he pushed the door open and crawled through the crack on the side there. Video surveillance shows what was happening inside Bayou Construction a few hours before Darren Freeman stopped by his shop. See, by his demeanor, he's not too worried. The general manager of Bayou Construction says he couldn't believe what he was watching. A burglar taking his time inside his business, relaxed enough to even check out the fridge. But the burglar ran into trouble when he tried to steal the shop's air compressor. He ended up leaving that. He guess he couldn't pick it up by himself, put it on his truck. The air compressor still sits in the shop, but a laptop just like this one and many other items are missing. You know, you just want to do something. You want to, you want to stop it. You know, you, you see them taking stuff that you work hard for. It's just pretty frustrating. This is the second time since March Freeman has been burglarized, but he's hoping several changes will stop burglars in their tracks. We're actually building gates, heavier duty gates to put in front of our doors to at least make it a little harder for them to, to gain access. They're also upgrading their camera system, improving the chances of identifying anyone who breaks into the shop. Sergeant Rob Flores believes someone recognizes the man in the video. You know, even though the security uh, video is, is kind of hazy and hard to make out, I promise you there's someone out there who knows who did this, and, and they're going to ultimately do the right thing and call us. Please return our stuff and um, you know, go get a job. <laughs> you know, find a job and try to, try to earn, earn your living you know, instead of taking it from other people. Darren Freeman hopes this is the last time he has to see something like this. In Beaumont, Justin Hinton, KFDM 6 News. Freeman says the man in the video got away with tools and caused damage. The total loss, $4,000. If you have any information about the crime, call Crime Stoppers at 833-TIPS.